aristocratic court, improve relations, diplo reputation. That or royal decree? Yearly absolutism, maximum absolutism. I think I want to improve relations. Yeah, I don't want parliament. Dynastic administration, yearly corruption. I probably deal with. A free monarch administrative skill is pretty good. Less yearly corruption, less advisor costs. I'm thinking dynastic administration. But economic matters. Merchant committees. Global trade power and ship trade power is pretty good, especially for us. More colonists? No. No. Just no. We are done colonizing by hand. We'll have our colonial nations do that for us. War economy? Maybe. Yeah, the inflation reduction. We are not gaining any passively, so I don't think that's quite worthwhile for us. Re trade? No. Domestic trade power? Maybe. Trade steering? Power. Burger snail. I'm thinking merchant committees. It does enable a parliament though. But I don't think it disallows the HRE stuff. Not that we can become HRE, they're pretty Catholic at this point. War economy though, maybe. That doesn't reduce market tourism. I think we'll do mercantilistic approach. Although, free trade. That would pull in a lot more and a lot quicker institution spread. I think I like it for the institutions but better. Legitimization. National unrest minus one. Liberty desire in subject. Definitely Leviathan, I think. I don't care about parliaments. Maybe the years of separatism, although we do not have a lot of separatism. Expansion impact is raised, so I'll take Leviathan. Absolutism. We currently have a max of how much absolutism? 40. Let us moi governing capacity, which we are currently. Yeah, it's the stability and expansion. We are currently quite a bit over. But that is definitely a possibility. Co creation costs, don't really care. Possible policies. I'll take let us and what. And then finally. Political absolutism. More maximum absolute, more admin efficiency, the right to petition monarch diplo skill, no stability loss on monarch debts, more flexible focus. I'll take the political absolutism. Yes. And now we can do stuff like royal managers. Neat. Who do I want to marry? 
France, definitely France. Yes, absolutely France. Probably Poland even. And probably Lithuania. Is there any succession I want? Not really, no. There are only two above our Diplo slot. But that's fine. Anyway, we need... Nothing, really. we just need to continue with our war. And we've taken province of Timrits. Perfect, let us liberate our vessel. Oh, Lithuania is coming in through Russia. Surprised they gave us access, really. But let's say. Okay. Let's defend that. I think I'll definitely be able to give Junagar a lot of Sin provinces. Each of Mansura. Oh, that's that province. Perfect. Definitely reinforce them there. We attack them with low morale. But we are winning quite heftily. Now, can I win that battle in Kutch? Well, I can't get there in time to prevent them from being stack wiped. I can probably get there in time to prevent them from turning around and going to Gujarat. Yeah, sure, we can probably win that. It's in the desert. It seems like Vianaga is coming to enforce us. Perfect. And it seems like we are... We do have our war goal. Perfect. Perfect indeed. If we can go to speed 4. Nothing really threatening us at the moment. We are marching south. But the Timurid's army is pretty spread out. Right. You also need to deal with the very northernmost Mexican rebels. Do I have other bombardments over here? I think I kind of want to start saving up our military power to make sure that we can get some strengthening of our government going. We do need more legitimacy. I will take it now. No real reason to wait there. Taking that province. Perfect. Don't really care about the Vianagar rebels. I think I'll start trying to go to jump or Can I get there? Right, something is going on. Okay, we need to get this fort first. Except this over here, I've been dealt with. New monarch, new pope has been elected. So nothing to do with us. Emirates. You are not willing to peace out yet. Let's we'll just have to keep on sieging. I think I might release some nations. 
Oh, over there, that is annoying. Because I currently don't have a stack available to deal with you. But I do have enough manpower, well, force limits, to make one. I need 30 marines. This is why I rarely use marines. Because it's just a pitch that you can't get them in a template. I think that's 10, right? Yes, that's 10. That should be 15. Okay. So we'll make those first. And get them some cannons. Like so. That's our 30 marines going. Let me get our fleet. He's already in Rome. Get them to Salerno. That's the most central one. Right. Can we get there in time to aid Vianagar? Mm, probably. No. That's shit. And I do not want... Do I want to attack myself? It is in the grasslands. I do have a decent general. Yeah, I think I do want to attack them there. Especially if I can attack only half of them. Let's attack by them. Right, that's in the jungle. A level 4. That's currently still being built. So we will catch them while it's still under construction. Right. You are almost completely built. There we go. That's a full dirty stack. We'll group them up and send them off to that island. And let's keep on marching into the Timurids. Who are still quite optimistic about the whole endeavor. But not for long, I bet. We had a... Right, we needed to switch their culture. Completely forgot about that, but apparently I already had it queued, so... I was allowed to forget about it. Our advice guide. Well. Get me the... Production efficiency guy. Can't upgrade you though. Yeah, I'll probably switch you... To something else then. But not yet. We will let them sort it out themselves. I need a diplo power for my trade ideas. Inca. No. I mean, that works. Vipers are truce with them. Oh, yes. Do ignore my proposal, that way I can just eat you. You're already marching back, you go siege that one, you go siege that one, and we'll eat the Inca. I mean, they're practically begging for it. Can even call in some allies. Because technically we are being attacked. I think, maybe. No, then they would be called in automatically. 
Anyway, the Inca are not long for this world. Right. That will be dealt with by my colonists. Probably. Let's assume it will be. That might actually be... It is a battle we won. Nice. Yes, let us definitely finish the trade ideas. And... Public Road Act will do very good things for us. We can get the idea cost we currently don't need. The produced modifier would be very good for us. An even bigger chance to capture enemy ships. No, currently we're not making that money that much monarch power. Let me get the national tax modifier guy and improve him. Can give them some support, that's fine. Right, so Timurits. I'm betting you are... Well, I was betting wrong. You're still not willing to peace out. Nice, we've got Inhambre. Each of Karlat. Finally finished. Let me go and guard the siege and then... Confirm Telesocracy. Merchant light ships. False naval tradition. Lux the tallest socracy government reform. I don't think there's any downside to this. Get a free merchant. Free tradition. There is no downside to that. That I know of at least. And the Tellus Socracy. Where is that? I don't see it immediately. It did say which one it was. Over here. Pulled by the sea, global trade power, level 4 limits, center of trade. In the global trade power alone is pretty good. But I think the embrace free trade might still be better. No longer surprise trade power to be used for the trading policy. I think that's improved land routes, yes. It gives artillery level against forts and siege ability. Keep forgetting that this exists, by the way. Improve relations. Maybe I should do some improved relations, but honestly, our coalition is not too bad. When is our two with Savoy, actually? Well, not Savoy, Naples. 45, and with Savoy, we don't have any. But France is right. France is gonna ding them, that's why. Oh well. You need to eat all of... ...of Austria. Or a mission. But I need more over here, I think. So what mission do I need to kill Austria? House of no. I need universities for that one. Play doctor, we don't need anything for. 
not conquer Savoy, destroy Austria. Diplo relations and unjustifies the demands for the rest of the game, that's pretty good. Maybe I do need to focus on you, also 45. Anyway. I want some raiders. One? Might as well get one over here collecting. And then Ethiopia is going to Gulf of Aden. We are going to the Gulf of Aden, yes. Honestly, you might want to collect here instead of transferring. Yes. We do not have a lot of... Not enough trade power over here. Deccan... Oh, I don't have one over here yet. I definitely should have one over here. Transferring, I think. As long as it doesn't go to the Cape of Good Hope. Trade note, then we should be fine. Timurids. You are willing to peace out. I don't think I take anything from you. That's fine. Right. You guys still need to send you over here before they go to Bermuda. Bermuda. Actually, let me send these guys first. I do need to give them a general if I still can. Well, let me land them first. Ooh, a very good mobility guy. That seems very fitting. Very fitting indeed. Kashmir. But we need to wait for some time before we can send another beast treaty. I... Do I need the money? Or the prestige guy? I think I do need the money. I do want to buy a province in China. So we can start expanding there. Right. Kashmir, I don't think I can take anything from you, so just leave. Since I definitely want to take quite a bit from you. All going to Chunara, Chunagar. I have no idea how to pronounce that. Well, it will go to my vessel. And... That means we can keep on carpet sieging. At least I think so. Don't poor. I think I just want you out of the war. I can't really take anything from you, but you might as well pay me. Make us white fuck not, right? Alright, now I can go to speed 5, allow my vessels to siege everything while I focus on sieging Sint. There we go. Oh, they even got a disaster, Gujarat. Nice. Alright. You can come all the way to Allah. Same with you. That all needs to be transferred over to Junarak. Preferably even the trade stuff. They all 
that's in the Gujarat trade node I need to switch over. Which is still annoying to do. Alright. All of that. Really, I can't take anything else. Did I not go blitz you? I did. Is it very well developed then? Only 6, 16. Okay, that's 34 development. But still, it costs so much. You are co -blitzerized. Why the hell does it cost so much? Hang on. If I take you for myself. Does it cost less? It would cost even more. Because there's a claim from Junaar over here and over here. Okay, guess we'll have to make do with three extra provinces. Yeah, coalition is still doing fine. Right. Definitely want these three provinces over here. We'll want this province to link it up. This province is also quite valuable, development-wise. And then we also want the... Trade... The trade provinces. Alright, we've got a new colonial nation in Australia. I forgot about that. The other one, you could go over here. Like so, I want to start sieging. And I have to convert, get away then. Did you manage to catch him there? I think so. Yeah, we, we ourselves do not have any rebels. Okay, perfect. Get back to Salerno. And we'll make you a proper stack. And then the fate against Australia. Okay. You're at war with Great Britain. Nothing I care about. For some reason I thought they would be at war with my Australia. Who chocolate imports? Definitely put a... well... I do need the manpower recovery speed. Yes. Oh, can we just make you see it? That thing, no. Alright, trade wise, I still want this occupation to move. I will just let the others do the sieging. In the meanwhile, I will get this over to our vessel. Perfect. That's the final siege that we needed. So let me see what I can take. Priority? Definitely this. Might as well take that. 
to link it up properly and we can get all the way to this trade province giving us a lot more trade power it would hurt our trust with via Nagar, but i do not really care about that coalition is looking manageable 